we are going to talk about props. So let's go to our scene with these two characters and let's add something to our scene. Um, you can click on this icon on the left side, on this panel, and you can see that you can again scroll down and search for things you would like to add to your scene or you can type on the top in this bar for what exactly you are looking for. So um, let's add, let's say, sun to our scene and let's see if there is any sun. So as you can see, we have this only sun. So I'm going to use it. I drag it to my scene, make it a little bit smaller and place it there. Um, let's say this this performance is somewhere outside, so we can add tree. And we have few option, options here. We have apple tree, Christmas tree, palm tree. So I like this palm tree. So I'm going to drag it to my scene and place it here on the right side of my scene. Let's say um, they perform in front of some building. So let's type building and see what we can choose from. It's a hospital, factory, um, school, church, elevator. So I like school. They will be performing in front of school. And as you, as you can see, when I dropped it on my scene, it's placed in front of them. And I would like to, for school to be um, behind them. So I'm just going to press this button here and bring, bring my characters in front. And I'm going to move school to the back. Okay, let's play them, place them here a little bit more in front. And maybe... This guy a little bit smaller and denser in front of him. So um, here we have scenes. We can also add children since it's school. So I go back to characters and type children and choose children I like for, for this scene. So here you can see that they are studying at school in the classroom so this wouldn't be suitable for our scene but we can have these boys walking out of school let's let's just make them smaller and place them somewhere here walking from school or towards the school actually if you would like them to walk away from school we flip them and they would walk away different direction Let's go and place them back facing the school. Okay, so here are the props and the same applies as for characters. We have few options what we can do with those uh, uh, with, with those props. We can flip them. It won't change my, much with that tree, but there's a little difference. Okay, let's place palm tree on the right side here. And as we talk about... Um, all these icons, they do the same for um, for the props. So you can place it exactly where you want it on the scene. You can make it smaller or bigger. You can change the color. So let's say we pull, we would like palm tree to appear green. So we like this green. When you press apply, the palm tree will be green. We can make sun yellow if you like. So let's go to the sun. Let's press gear icon, change the color of drawing to orange, let's say. Press apply. Our sun will be orange. Uh, if you like school to be um, brownish color, let's, let's, let's make it brown. And um, we leave children and drummer and dancer black. It's very important to 
to the right timing and you have to decide if you want the characters to be drawn or to just appear instantly. So I will show you the difference. So let's say we would like to start a scene with school. So school will be first. And then we would like to have palm tree drawn, sun drawn. So we, we find the sun and pl place it third. So it, it means that the sun will be drawn third. Then we will have children and then we would have drummer let's see drummer first and then dancer and all of them are set at this time to be drawn and to uh, duration for drawing will be three seconds so let's put three seconds Okay, you can see that, uh, let me just make it bigger. You can see that delay is zero. It means, it means that when first icon is drawn, school, right after it finishes, palm tree starts to be drawn. And again, when palm tree finishes, sun is going to start to be drawn. Let's, let's have a look how it looks. So I go to... To the scene, press Control Command Preview, and the scene is done. It takes what three seconds. Then we have palm tree, then sun, then children who should come. Okay, then is drummer, and the last the last one is dancer. Okay, so. If you like everything to appear just at the same time, you will put duration to zero, which means that any of these characters or props will be drawn. They will just appear on the scene. So let's put them on zero and let's have a look what the difference is with just appearing on our scene. Okay, here also zero. And let's press preview. You can see also that this length of the scenes changes. It's going to take only a few seconds. And these two seconds, I think they are two seconds, or half of the seconds. So it means that extra time at the end of the scenes is only half seconds. I usually put it for two seconds so people can register what is on the scene and kind of absorb the scene. So as I put it to two seconds, you can see that it became this line larger. So it means that the time for the scene is longer. Okay, so let's preview this scene. Again, common controlled comment preview. And as you see, all the characters, they appear at the same time. Okay, what about you would like sun, school, and tree appear instantly and we would like our characters to be drawn so that means that sun school and palm tree has to have delay and duration on zero which they do and then uh, we have to decide which character we would like to to be drawn first let's one children we put them on duration for three seconds then it will be drummer we're going to put him for three seconds. And the last will appear denser and he will be drawn for three seconds. Okay, so let's preview this scene. As you see, sun, school, and tree is, are already there. Children are being drawn, then drummer, and the last is denser. So you can always play with the scene and make them appear as you like, who would like to go first, who, who would like to go second. Um, you can choose which character should be drawn, which character should just appear. Let's play a little bit more. Let's see if I just want the drummer to be drawn and everything else appear. So I put children to the zero. 
I put then set to zero and drummer last will be drawn. Okay. Here it is. Just the drummer is drawn. So you can play with this and really create a scene the way you like it. I just want to show you how the scene would look like if you have rainbow option. So you can go to the scene setting and turn on rainbow. You press OK, apply, and you will see how it would look in color. And here it is. This would be in color. So you can always turn it on or off if you have rainbow version. Um, you might decide later on, oh, I think it would look much better in color. You can always turn it on on the scene with this button here. I turn it off at the moment, press apply, okay. and here it is.